All right, so let me put this right here and then put that over there. So now, yeah, I think it was funny. Uh, the other day I started talking about Stockholm Syndrome on, uh, on, on Twitter. And when, I, when I, I brought this up, it was probably about a week or two ago. I thought it was funny that um, Tucker Carlson actually brought this up when we talked about when he's talking about the modern left and uh, like a couple of days after I did on Twitter. Now, one thing that really stuck out to me about when you look up Stockholm Syndrome. Now, let me go ahead and read for most of us have a general idea. But one thing that actually didn't stick out to me was the last part of this definition um, uh, that w when it comes to this, so stock. So let me go ahead and stop it. Stockholm syndrome, psychology word, of course, uh, term. We already know this. Stockholm syndrome, physical response wherein a captive uh, uh, begins to identify closely with his or her captors. Now, I think we all knew that, right? We all knew that, and then that. Okay, we got that. But what stuck out to me even more is where it says, as well as their agenda and demands. That that right there to me was even more so like, yikes, you know, like, you know, that's very, very true. So let me go ahead and read. And, and this is something in response to this. This is something that someone that um, that uh, that follows me on Twitter uh, posted. And I was like, I want you to uh, see better without him. Um, I want you to send me this so that I can kind of go over this. And that, now this is where, we, where it comes to with the modern left as far as I'm concerned. So it says 15 signs that you are, you are, that you might be in an abusive relationship. So we'll go to number one. You stop seeing other friends and family. What are you, what, what, what are, what is one of the first thing that a person does whenever, whenever, whenever they say, well, uh, um, I had to, oh, I had to cut off my Trump supporting family. This is, and I think that was, uh, what was it? That there wasn't there a study on Facebook that says something about, uh, that left wing people are more likely to, to di uh, unfriend people on Facebook that that's, you know, that, that, there you go. I'm not going to go. I'm not, I'll read all of these, but I'm not going to elaborate on every single one of them. I think we can all figure this out, but won't, uh, number two, won't let you go out without permission. COVID rules said uh, to show us a little something on that tells you what to wear mask uh, monitors your phone or emails. We've seen we've seen that when it comes to the J6 and uh, hell, we even starting to see something like that in uh, Canada when it comes to the um, the uh, them seizing bank accounts and all that control the finances or won't let you work. Lockdown rules. Let's be honest. Uh, controls what you read and what to uh, watch and say. Mentor uh, or monitor everything you do. Punish you for the breaking the rules, but the rules keep changing. <laughs> Tells you it is for your own good and they know better. Fauci saying that I am science. That that really that really uh, stands out. Now, uh, don't allow you to question it. Uh, tells you you're crazy and no one agrees with you. Uh, what is it? Uh, calls you names or shame you for being stupid or or selfish? When they say that about the mask, when they say you you uh, you anti-masker, you're being selfish. Gaslight you, challenge your memory of events, make you doubt yourself. One of these just one of that. This one just came out when we talked when they talked about what was it when it came to defunding the police and Jen Psaki sat up there and said, "Hey, you know what? Uh, no, Republicans were actually for defunding the police. Republicans were actually for lockdowns." This is a, this is a freaking lie. Uh, dismisses your opinions, plays plays the victim. If you if you go wrong, it's all your fault. Now, here's the thing. When I when when we br when we go back to what was the other one where it says you as you identify closely with your captors, the person you're in an abusive relationship with, as well as with their agenda and demands. Nothing more br brazenly just pokes out at me as much as wanting to go def de uh, uh, defend Ukraine's borders over U.S. border. They're, these people are telling you what is more important to you. All while knowing that it's not more important to you, that it's not the, in your best interest or affect your day li daily life. That to have to um, to have uh, Ukraine's border protected versus our own. 
Let's be honest here. We all know this. When they're telling you what is important to you, that gas prices, that doesn't matter to you. Actually, what matters is is bringing in as many people into this country illegally as we poss as, uh, 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 illegally as we possibly can, so that we can give them citizenship, so that we can change the the, uh, the whole demographic of of, uh, of of the voting populace. Where they tell you that it is quite okay. There's nothing wrong with the fact that all of your most of your manufacturing jobs are leaving and letting it go to another country that hates you. When it comes to progressives, it's one thing to, to, to sit back and try to tell people like me that me paying off my tax dollars going to someone else to pay off someone else's student debt will somehow benefit me. That, that, that's what I really need in my life is someone to is 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 to pay someone else's student loans off. You start to identify with your captors and even bigger and more important to me is the fact that you put their agenda above your own. These people are telling you that it is OK. I saw that, that now I didn't get that screen grab. I probably should have got it in the Washington Post. It said in the in, in it, there was an actual headline in the long run. War is actually makes us safer and more in and, 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 and richer or something like that. It's more beneficial to us for us to go to go to war with other countries and other lands and protect other countries. That's just better for us. You start identifying with your captors and you start and you in their goals, even if they don't make any sense for in your day to day life. That's what's important. That's suddenly what's more important to you now. Comment, like, share, subscribe. We'll see you on the next one. All right.